For this incredibly ingenious trick you should place tin foil in boiling water. Watch this video to find out what it does and why you absolutely have to try it. Take a pan or pot and pour water into it. The exact amount depends on the size of the pan or pot, but we'll come to that in a moment. In the next step you will need aluminum foil. In addition to the aluminum foil we also need a few other ingredients. Firstly add a tablespoon of baking soda to the water. We also need salt. You should now take two tablespoons of this. If you have both in the pan you can stir it a little and then you should switch on the hob. Stir it a little and wait until it slowly simmers. Now the aluminum foil comes into play. You can shape it into small balls. I used four pieces and they end up looking something like this. Now add them to the pan. Simply place them in the water and then comes the last and most important step. Because there's a very specific reason why you should now add your cutlery, specifically certain pieces of your cutlery. The reason for this is quite simple. The baking soda and salt contains electrolytes that react with the aluminum foil. This creates a voltage, which is exactly what we want to generate. Now leave the whole thing to simmer gently on your hob for about 10 minutes. When you see the before and after result you will definitely want to try it out. By the way, if you don't have baking soda at home, you can also find it in my shop. You can find the link in the video description below. My cutlery looked like this before. It had unslightly stains and discoloration. But after the treatment, it shines like new again because all the stains have now been removed by this mixture. This is how you can make old silver cutlery shine again. By the way, did you know why you should put a clothes pack on your shower? I'll show you in a video you see on the screen now. Click on it directly.